Russia launched a multi-wave overnight attack on Ukraine using 70 air assault weapons, including cruise and hypersonic missiles and Iranian-made drones, Kyiv's Air Force said on Sunday, August 6. At least 10 missiles appeared to get through air defenses. Ukraine's air defense destroyed 30 out of 40 cruise missiles and all 27 of the Shahid drones that Russia launched overnight. The Air Force, which is celebrated in a holiday on Sunday, said on the Telegram messaging channel. It also said Russia launched three Kinshill hypersonic missiles, but did not disclose any further information on them. In total, in several waves of attacks, from the evening of August 5 to the morning of August 6, 2023, the enemy used 70 means of air assault weapons, the Air Force said. Reuters could not independently verify the report. There was no immediate comment from Russia. It was not immediately clear whether there was any damage from the overnight attack or what happened to the 10 cruise missiles that were not shot down. The deputy governor of the Khmelnytsky region in western Ukraine, Serhii Tyrin, said that a military airfield in Starokostyantinov was among the targets. The Starokostyantinov airfield is on the enemy's mind. There was a series of explosions in Starokostyantinov and Khmelnytsky communities, he said on messaging app Telegram. Most of the missiles were shot down by air defense forces. Tyron said explosions had damaged several private houses, a communal cultural institution and the bus station and that a fire had broken out at a grain silo. Air Force spokesman Yuri Inet told the national Ukrainian broadcaster that one of the key targets for Russia's overnight attack was the Khmelnytsky region. Now, it is the Starokostyantinov airfield that haunts the enemy, Inet said. Russia had earlier targeted the Starokostyantinov military airfield in the Khmelnytsky region at the end of July.